Uh, I am from a family that is already a two-time victim of maternal mortality. Uh, I lost my two aunts to maternal death. Mm -hmm. One was immediately, she delivers, one died during the delivery already. Maternal mortality is not one man fight and sitting behind the table to develop strategies alone is not enough to settle the problem. So I think if I involve in the process it's more better than sitting behind the table. And that is one of the reasons that my boss, the chairman of uh, the Kappa Care International Board, he founded Kappa Care and together with the Ministry of Health and Sanitation here in Sierra Leone, he initiated the task sharing program. The SACHO is when you graduated as a surgical training student. It means uh, surgical assistant community health, of, health officer. So the surgical training program, this was like to capacitate no physicians, no medical doctors to make sure that they do like tax shifting or tax sharing, wherein even if you are not an, a medical doctor, but like if you are a physician assistant, you can do life-saving skill surgeries that will help to reduce maternal death within our country or so. For me, I, I like the job so much. You can really see that you are doing something to save someone's life. Yeah. The qualification should be you are a physician assistant or community health officer and have worked for like two years. So you have a two years working experience and then you can apply and then screen. And then if you have been admitted, you spend like two years training and then one year housemanship like you will spend one year on the obstetrics and the emergency unit and then one year at the general surgical unit and so if you have been satisfied that yes you can do surgery on your own and then they will post you to the regional hospitals where you can assist and do a lot of surgery by yourself to make sure that you save life. And at the moment, um, we have around 35, we have 35 graduates. 29 of them are posted by the Ministry of Health and Sanitation. And as we speak at the moment, they have reached, and this is the data from 2017, so it's more now. They always almost reached at that moment 50,000 surgeries. That's 25% of all the surgical activity in Sierra Leone. So it's really good, and to me, Sierra Leone can be capacitated to make sure that they capture some of the, you know, the areas that they feel that they are lacking a lot of things. Yeah, <laughs>